Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Apparently, we have a couple of news stories today on a 37 date numerology. Did you all hear the story from the Olympic Games of the 13 year old Japanese girl that won the gold medal 37 days before her upcoming birthday? Nashia Manaji. Notice her birthday is August 30th. From the date of this news, July 25th, 2021, to her upcoming birthday, 37 days. Notice gold medal in the most pure cipher sums to 37. Apparently, this is big news. The Olympic Games, they're just as rigged as the rest of professional sports, even 13 year olds. This made me laugh as well on the 37 date numerology. Slow Joe comes out and says the gun violence approval rating has fallen 37% amid rises in shootings. And again, today's date numerology 7 plus 25 plus 2 plus 0 plus 2 plus 1, 37. We have somebody win the gold medal 37 days before her upcoming birthday, and Slow Joe's gun violence rating falls supposedly 37%. On a 37-day numerology, Joe Biden, 37. Notice it's also a date with 53 numerology. Gun violence sums the 53. You learn their language, the language of Gematria, you see through it in seconds. Did you see CNN's front page story? Not vaccinated. Don't go to bars or restaurants. (laughs) Hey, CNN, what do you think about me, huh? Ever since the pandemic was declared, ever since we first heard about coronavirus, I haven't been wearing a mask, never have, never will. I've gone to mass gatherings, restaurants, sporting events. Don't have a single needle in me, not a single shot by the two companies that are making the coronavirus vaccine, known for killing people, Pfizer and Johnson & Johnson. What do you think about that, CNN, huh? I'm as healthy as a horse, healthy as I've ever been. I would never go to a bar to drink this bullshit, put all the sugar, unnecessary poison and carbohydrates in my body. When you can live in a log home in the middle of the woods and drink purified well water. Oh, man. if you read this article, it, uh, it starts going on and talking about how, uh, We need to be alarmed in the United States because only 50% of the country is fully vaccinated. And you know what's funny? Have any of you actually known anybody who has been vaccinated who hasn't gotten sick immediately? And And they're trying to come out and tell you that it's the people who aren't vaccinated that are unhealthy. Do I look unhealthy? Like I said, I haven't followed any of the mask mandates. I haven't followed any of the social distancing, any of the quarantine bullshit. Follow me on Twitter where we got the uh, the only shot I'll take from the government is return fire. That's what's up right there. (laughs) Every like, like legit though. Every person I've known who has gotten the vaccine has become very, very ill within hours, within like within like literally a 12 hour period. Something tells me that all the deaths they're reporting are probably from. Yeah, it's probably medical misinformation to say this, but given that Pfizer and uh, Johnson and Johnson are two companies known for killing people. Chances are the deaths they're reporting on are the people that have been jabbed versus the people that haven't. Seven people are dead and several others injured in a standstorm that leads to 20 vehicle crash in Utah. 
flooding in London submerges roads and some trains. Four shootings in Seattle leaves three dead. <laughs> I remember that four shootings in Seattle leaves three dead. Remember Seattle Mariners or, or Seattle Kraken 43, Seattle Seahawks 43, Mariners 43. Four shootings, three dead. They love that number in Seattle. Seahawks win their only Super Bowl with 43 points. I mean, <laughs> don't you just love the media? Just nothing but positivity, right? Unbelievable. Two charged with allegedly hitting police horse during anti-lockdown protest. <laughs> you follow the media, you get your daily dose of negativity. Till next time.